The Department of Mathematics has a rich history and housed many prominent mathematicians, including Dedekind, Minkowski, Frobenius, Armand Borel, Heinz Hoff. And to commemorate our past colleagues today, the Department of Mathematics awards biannually the Heinz Hoff Prize. Also, we have housed the International Congress of Mathematics three times, including the inaugural one, and also once the International Congress for Industrial and Applied Mathematics in 2007. The Department of Mathematics houses about 250 mathematicians from many countries and backgrounds. Additionally, it houses three institutes, Institute for Applied Mathematics, Operations, Research and Statistics. It works very closely with the Research Institute, FIM, which organizes many conferences and supports an active visitors program. FIM means Forschungsinstitut für Mathematik, uh, which literally uh, means Institute for uh, Mathematical Research. My role as a director is to elaborate a program for scientific collaborations. Uh, we organize conferences with either broad thematics or uh, more focused uh, workshops. Uh, we are also implementing a special graduate course program, the so-called NAR Diplom for Lisung, uh, which are uh, maybe more known under the name of uh, uh, lectures in Zurich. We are inviting mathematicians from uh, almost all fields of mathematics, uh, going from the most pure to the most applied. We are getting strong and steady support from ETH, as well as from the Swiss National Foundation. And I should say this is very important for us to feel that there is a high consideration from uh, our home institutions for uh, mathematical research uh, in its full uh, diversity. The applied side of our department is organized in different groups. Uh, there is a group in optimization, a group in numerical analysis, a group in uh, financial and insurance mathematics, and a group in statistics. And I am part of the statistics group. And the department is actively involved in different initiatives uh, regarding data science. And since data science is highly interdisciplinary, we do most of this together with two other departments, uh, electrical engineering and computer science. My research focuses mostly on causality, graphical models and high dimensional statistics. And I am particularly interested in causality or in causal questions. And those are questions about the underlying mechanism behind the data or about making predictions about the system in a new state when an, when an intervention to the system is, is made. For example, if we observe gene expression levels of a certain organism, then we would like to try to understand which genes affect which other genes or we would like to predict a certain output, like a phenotype or, or disease status, after the system is changed, uh, meaning that certain genes, for example, have been knocked out. In the last years, I've been mostly working on free boundary problems. And more, more specifically, I'm currently studying the structural interfaces in phase transitions. And for instance, when you have ice melt into water and you want to understand the structure of the surface that separates these two phases. Mathematics is all about creativity. You want to solve a problem that has been open for years or sometimes for decades and more. And so the only way to succeed is to find new tools, develop new techniques, and at the same time maybe have new insights, bring techniques from different areas, make connection. In the all different periods that I spent here, the atmosphere was always nice. In particular, I always find very nice people to work with. So people coming from the Europe, but also from more far away. And they were always very interesting people, inside and outside the university also. And I had the impression that everybody could find here something interesting to learn. I moved to ETH Zurich seven years ago, mostly attracted by three aspects here. First, ETH itself. It's a science community with an international profile. ETH is a federal university at the summit of uh, an outstanding educational system in Switzerland. Uh, secondly, uh, the cosmopolitan city of Zurich with its uh, vibrant cultural offering and at the center of Europe. And last but not least, uh, symplectic geometry, my mathematics field of choice. 
Symplectic geometry is significantly stimulated by important interactions with algebraic geometry, mathematical physics, low dimensional topology, um, dynamical systems, partial differential equations, representation theory, etc. Um, we might say that uh, mirror symmetry at the interface of symplectic and algebraic geometries is one of the most exciting current interaction locus in mathematics. If you would like to visit ETH Zurich, we would be very happy to host you in our departments. We have many uh, exciting events and conferences, uh, and we look forward to receiving you in Zurich, in the center of Europe.